Welcome back to... Oh, hey. Hello. Hello. Pizza cat here, a little. Wait a minute. Little pizza man here. Yeah, Wait what? a minute. Something looks wrong. I wonder who these who these people are. I think they might be somebody. Well, welcome back to Pizza Tower. We've reached the end of our journey, and today, whoops, oh, today we will be finishing the Pizza Tower, reaching the top, and besting Pizza Face, and putting an end to this great conspiracy. Turns out Pizza Face is just a you know a guy in a suit. And the real evil is Papa. I really think Papa John's comes out. Damn it, not that look, way. Look, I don't know. Yonoi 2 had the, the the head of Domino's or something like that. I don't know. Hi, S Snotty. Snotty's still good, still alive. Even though you're just jumping on his freaking head. <laughs> what are you <laughs> doing? Didn't kill him. We, we like to have fun, me and Snotty. <laughs> Here's like, the secret. Whoa! The mansion. Oh. It's... Unused enemies? It's everybody in the pizza tower. Oh. All the toppins and all the characters mm, and... Some of these folks I haven't seen. Some of them. Grandpa Bowl. There's a golf ball. Like, there's the, one of the cannon goblins. That that looks like a... Yeah, they all look like people we've seen. I mean, some of them look familiar. Just not all of them. Whee! Oh, yeah, we helped out an old guy. We did. What happened there? But he's gone. He's gone now. Took your money and ran. Yeah, well, oh. he, he gave us a special, uh, the color shirt. It was orange. Oh, it's... Uh. Don't like that. Nope. Uh. Still don't like that. Uh. 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 Oh. oh, that... Uh, okay. Okay. Stop it. Something to say? Huh? All right. Stop it. All right. Oh. Uh. uh hello? <laughs> Did I catch you at a bad time? I wasn't ready for guests! Can we take a shower? Because we're a dirty boy? Doesn't look like it. No time to shower. Damn it. It's time for war. Oh. We are now outside the pizza tower. Almost climbed to the top. Hey, I wonder if we jump off, what would happen? Oh, come on! Oh, duh. Fun detail. There is no death in Pizza Tower, That's it's a just mean, you hurt Pepino. It's a mean, cruel joke. He just take you back to the beginning. I don't believe this. Imagine if there was a difficult platforming segment around there. Oh, I don't know why you, why you say such things. Because I remember the rainbow secret from Mario 64. I've hurt before. It's fine. Yeah, it's okay. I, 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 I see your pain. I missed the pole by a couple centimeters. Oops. Well, let's get on to it! I'm just gonna... Just gonna let this play out because I love all three versions of the song that play here. I'm and not. I'm not getting a P rank, by the way. I feel like. Why not? I don't want to. Okay. And I decided not to. Hey, it's our pizzeria. And Pizza Face. Well, no wonder why you're, you're not making any money, uh, Pepino. You're out in the middle of nowhere. So how, you, so how you take down Pizza Face? Is you throw enemies at him, and then he's like, "Whoa, I didn't expect that," and then you hit him. It's a very, uh, Mario World boss-esque thing, if you ask me. Very Bowser, yes. Yes. I see that. And that's why we're not getting a P rank. Because I don't care. Eh. Then I don't want to. Yeah, the frequency of enemies starts to increase. You get multiple enemies, uh, ones that just jab you with forks. How dare. Just random enemies. Sometimes they throw explosives and run around the whole stage. Yeah, not that's a, fun. Not a fan of that. Yeah, that's fun. That's oh, cool. Oh, it's a nightmare. I mean, look at all this garbage. And this is just, what, hit number four that you're about to hit him? Yep. Uh, that was that was, that was four. Yeah, yep. time, to, time to increase it a little bit more. Ow. Yeah, look. Fork guy already. All right, we could do start to do a little better here. Let's get a little bit of the skill going on. There we go. All right. Three left. By the way, if you're watching this episode and wondering what this track is called in the background, Unexpectancy. There are three waves. I read a theory that Unexpectancy uh, re that refers to you being here. Pizza Face didn't think you could make it up the pizza tower. Pizza, like, you caught him in the shower. It's like, oh, uh -oh. You're, you're actually fucking here. Oh, well, I mean, uh, hang on. <laughs> ah, Peppino, you have made it to the top. Peppino, you fool. And not only that, you actually, like, won? Boom! Okay. Right, here we go. Let's drop the facade. I'm gonna be very quiet. The for true this. villain. I love this song. A gun? I appreciate it, Pizza Face. Let's go! 
I absolutely love this part of the boss fight. You're dealing with a giant cartoon mascot. And the unexpectedcy is that this is the true villain. This is Pizza Face. Uh-huh. He's got a huge multitude of attacks and they're all cartoon based. I, I love when he sees a poster of himself. He's like, oh no, I got to read it. There's an interesting bit here on one of his attacks. I'm waiting for it. Show me. Oh, oh it's like, whoa, what's this? Oh, <laughs> it's firing a lot. <laughs> that Uzi is a doozy. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> he would definitely have a voice like that. There we go. Yeah. And of course the television's at well, it's your own screaming face. <laughs> on that's pretty ballsy to throw your own screaming face at you, throw your own enemy's screaming face right at him. I love the background too, it's all become pizza faceified! So when pizza head, or, or yeah, uh, pizza face is all ah. looking crazy. Alright, so look at that. That's the sword from Pizzascape. Oh, shoot! I didn't even notice. Even with his big muscly arm, he, can, he can't lift it out. He is but not Pepito worthy. Can. He's not worthy. Pepito is worthy! But this guy's invincible. And then he throws... Uh -oh. Uh oh. Oh dear. Oh no. He's he oh, throws no. all the bosses all at us. And then he basically goes Super Saiyan and kicks the crap out of him. Pepino ain't having any of this. He is having absolutely zero per zero point zero percent of this, no way! I read a YouTube comment while listening to uh level listening to this boss theme and they said, I love this as a final boss theme. No, you're not fighting all these enemies. You're the final boss for them. You are the final boss! And it's about to be another try again, gamer! <laughs> and I also love how uh, you're beating the crap out of them as much as possible. He's you're basically going through their phases. He's dancing, look at him! With one health bar. I, I, I love... The, that's my favorite idle animation of his, where he's just like, Yeah! yeah get uh, down with uh, it! Uh, down tonight! I think that's just pure Italian rage leaking out of every orifice right now. Gustavo shows if he can throw him. He's like, yo, go Pepino, you can take him. He's you like, take you him. come here, go throw it at him, guy. I'm just waiting for all the Ed, Ed, Nettie sound effects to happen during during a fight like this. It's already happened. <laughs> they already made one. Ah. There we go, yeah. <laughs> That's the one I was thinking of. The sumo, yeah. The absolute perfect sumo sound effect. I can't tell you how many times I've cry laughed at the sound effect <laughs> gags at Ed and Nettie. <laughs> cry laughed, Niskel. Alright, time for the noise. Time for the noise! He's, well, easier than the Vigilante, yeah. I say. Uh, the Vigilante is, like, on a different level. Like, if you can beat the Vigilante and get a P rank on there, everybody else should just should be fine. You see, I thought for a second that this game was literally gonna throw every bro every boss in my way and I had to refight them all over again. That would be mean. It'd also kill the pace. And while I, yes, I am indeed defighting all the bosses all at once, I only have to hit them four times and I've got this Super Saiyan, you know, uh, uh, Hokuto no Ken, you know, hundred hand slap. Insert other, you know, ta ta type. We attack. call it the ancient art of. I've get. I don't. You gave a shit anymore. Get out of my face. Yeah, see, I think Pepino's been through a lot, and he's just finally snapped. Yeah, I'll go for that. I appreciate that. He's man enough to know when he's lost his shit. <laughs> really, it's a. Uh... A statement about mental health that uh, pizza can solve all mental health problems. <laughs> yeah, you just gotta beat up your competition, that's all. I forgot what to do here. It's like, oh yeah, hit him. Although, hit who's, him. The, who's hit the real competition? Is Pizza Face the real competition, or does Pizza Face see Pepino as a worthy adversary? You see, I think, I think Pizza Face yeah, is, is that uh, corporation, that, that, that uh, junky kind of pizza that you don't really think about. You know, like, like, they're like Domino's. They're Domino's. They're clearly Domino's. Cheap crap pizza, but hey, you know we're everywhere. We got the we got the the the, the neat gimmicks, and you know we got we got a, we got mascots. We got we got homogeny. We got we got all this stuff. We'll never go away. You can't kill us no matter what you do. Yeah. I mean, I, I just took his health down, and he's still not dying yet. That was another thing I uh, saw online. A really good point is uh, Pizza Face is supposedly the embodiment of corporate bullshit pizza. <laughs> Like, yeah, it, I, mean, I, I, I get it. All chain pizza's corporate somehow, but like, you know, the most corporate bullshit of, of pizza you know. We're talking like schmaltzy, you know, try to get people in here with the goofy mascot and everything. He's got three attacks now that you're on phase three of pizza phase. You know, that kind of BS. But Pepino, even though he can't afford shit. Mon Pa Shop Pizza, best kind. Best pizza. It's it's the equivalent of that episode of SpongeBob where he goes up against King Neptune. Yep. Make it with love. And he and, and just because he makes it with love, 
It's like, why, this is so good, I want to try it a second, second time. time! Except he's a little bit less, uh, f forgiving and benevolent. And he's a bit more, yes, yeah. I'll just him. kill ya! But we got him! And now for the final blow! We hit him so hard, we begin to levitate! <laughs> we have gained aviation with the power of our hatred and our rage and our sheer it's power! It's Italian An Italian Azuna drop from the heavens onto the top of the tower! <laughs> And Pizza Face has, has that stare on his on his front, just be like, "What on earth is happening?" Well, and he did it. I think we got him. Yeah, you you beat Pizza Face, and you saved Pepino's pizza. All right, all right, cool. Well, uh, guess we'll just the, sniff, know. sniff feet. Ah, D dance on his yeah, corpse? break dance on that fool. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Yeah. <laughs> and you thought it was over. No, it's not over yet. We've got one final challenge before we can put this in the books. This is a pizza tower level. It's the crumbling tower of pizza. That means you gotta run. It's already pizza time! Is that the original John Gutter block, I assume? That's the final one, the last one. The last mutation or creation by and Pizza Face. So to keep the, the uh, Ed Ed Netty jokes going, that was indeed the support beam to the house. Yes! So now the whole place is falling over, and we have to go through the entire pizza tower, including the hub world that we just went through, and a few bonus places to connect them, with a whole bunch of challenges that we've seen in all of our challenge and uh, all of our all the levels on the way through. And, uh, well, we only got five minutes to get through it all. And save our friends, that's important too. Basically the game asking you, hey, do you remember when you did this? Do it again. Well, we're gonna test you. Yeah. Put it all together into one big package. And what? So, the, I, these are the TV rooms. I think it's believed that oh. Pizza Face has been watching you this whole time. Oh, I mean that makes sense. You're just one channel over. That, ex that explains your, you know, all the faces, all that. That's that's him actively monitoring you. So what we're actually seeing is Pepino's reflection on the different televisions. Why this right now could be just one of the many screens we're watching on. And he's looking at those faces just going, how did I lose to this schmuck? How unexpected. Ah, uh, part one. The unexpected sees through the roof! I don't think I, I don't think we even uh, talked about how good unexpectancy, uh, specifically part two. Part two sounds amazing. It's using samples from a song from the 30s, I 20s. believe. 20s. 1920s is when it was made. So, of course, it's public domain as hell. Yeah. And he, he, he resampled it to make it as insane and cartoony as, as as menacing as possible, and it's it's one of my favorites on the track. On an already banging fucking soundtrack. Yes. Has the OST been released? Yes. Okay, cool. I don't know why I asked that. I own it. God. Hey, does this thing I bought exist? Yeah, I, I don't know. It's, it's possible I also just got it from, like, an upload, so... Oh, you know what? I've never actually heard this track. Like, I've listened to a lot of the tracks in the OST, but didn't actually listen to this one. I don't really take the time to listen to this one because I'm just so desperate to try and get go, out of go, the falling go, go, go. tower. Everything's everything's falling apart. I don't think we've uh, uh, mentioned that yet. Oh yeah, the entire pizza tower's going down. Yeah, everything everything's going to shit. Oh god. So hey, and it, it turns out that instead of a nuclear laser destroying my restaurant. I go ahead and systematically dismantle his tower from the inside out! Board <laughs> by board, uh, brick by brick! Oh yeah, you're saving friends as you go along, and they cost, or not cost oh. points, but give you points. There we go. So I think uh, the S rank for this is different than the uh, P rank for the boss. Correct. Uh, the boss is its own P rank. But you won't see the rank score in either of those. Oh, really? They made a golf course. Yep. And I've already messed it up. And we need to get a prime bird to escape? Nah, it's, it's, it's just a prime yeah. bird probably gets you the points that you would need for an S or, oh. or P rank. Hey, hot dog! But we'll take a hot dog anyway! Rather have a hot dog than nothing. And immediately get kicked by a cow <laughs> down the storm drain. Whee! So that's what we get for not getting the primo bird. Now the cows are alive to kick me. <laughs> the cows have come back. Well, if I were designing this, I'd make that joke. I am so freaking happy that I called what was going to happen. And I still haven't beaten this game yet. I've seen the bosses, but I haven't seen all the levels. 
I knew we were gonna have to go through the entire pizza tower again. We got more. It was perfectly set up for it. I love it. Yay. Well, all those John blocks are suspiciously placed throughout the hub world. It's like, what's this doing what here? What's this doing this here? This has got to mean something. I That's like prob it. Yeah, it could be nothing. Who knows? Uh, this creator saying, ah, uh -uh, don't go back there. That's for the DLC Staff later. Staff only. Staff only. I'd love some DLC. I was just I'll, thinking. I'll, I'll, I'll pay whatever for more of Pizza Tower. I'm just thinking, if you add, like, one more floor between uh, Fake Fafino and Pizza Face, that'd be kind of cool. The shed that leads underground. Yeah, the shed. Or, you know, after you've beaten the game, you can leave the tower, go back to Pepino's Pizza, and all of a sudden there's more levels there. Something like that. I don't know. Sounds fun. Now we got Pepper Man. I think that's everyone. That's everyone. Oh, and there's, oh, uh, there's, there's a, a Jerome. Oh, oh, go, go, go. Oh, come on. That was a slam dunk of just running forward. I panicked. I'm oh, sorry. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh, man. Yeah, I was lame. I know. You didn't bring fake Pepino with you. We got him. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see him. We got new clothes. He's for beating the game twice. Ah, that's what that's for. Well, we did it. Good job, everybody. Good job, everybody. Aww. Here's the true ending. John Gutter. You get all the treasures, and they restore John Gutter to his original form. Oh. No. Because Pizza Head will, or Pizza Face will be just fine. Except, nah. Out of here. Yay! Yay! Everyone's happy, and he got his comeuppance! Mission accomplished! And that was Pizza Tower! Gone too soon, but I loved every second of it. Oh, one of the one of the best games I've played in a long time. This is this is. And they went when they said they went to they wanted to make a successor to the Wario Land series. They weren't kidding. I still love the day Pizza Tower came out. <laughs> you sent me a message saying. Pizza Tower's out! And what were you playing at that very moment? Oh, I have Pizza Tower. Okay, cool. Yeah, Pizza Tower. I, I was so excited for this, and it absolutely 100% delivered. Met my expectations and exceeded them. What a, what a fantastic, lovely game. I look forward to whatever else that these guys end up doing. And it's just, it's just an absolutely delight to play, to watch, to see, and everything in between. Yeah, that was fun to... <laughs> That was fun to watch. Yeah, I really like this. Uh, I think the only reason I stopped is because I didn't really want to play it on Steam. But that was because I was having back problems. I couldn't sit in my computer chair long, so I was just like, well, if this comes to consoles, I'll try it then. Well, if only there was a way to, you know, bring that to to this big screen over here. If only there was a way to... My controller doesn't reach. It doesn't reach?! It doesn't. What do you mean it <sighs> The XBL, the, the Xbox One doesn't work anymore, and <laughs> my PC cord can't reach the the PS4 controller. Just it's buy so a sad. just buy a 10 foot USB cable, plug it into whatever controller uh, you like. And there you, it's it's not hard. This is not hard. <laughs> Come on, man. Look at that Pepino rodeo down there. Well, I love it. What about you? Any uh, any final thoughts? No, I should probably beat this game, huh? Well, I mean, uh, it, it might it might seem short, but I could see myself co coming back to this time and time and time again. I mean, you did. Well, you came back to it well, yeah. to play it again. I mean, if it ever comes to Steam, I'm probably going to play that over and over again. I imagine I'll probably be like, you know, hey, Pizza Tower, I'll give that another run through. Just like I do with Warrior Land 3, just like with Warrior Land 4, just like with you know, all the old Kirby games. This, this is just a bona fide classic, and... Once you figure out how to play it, I think it's going to be uh, a lot of people's favorites, too. One of, the already. one of the original ideas we had for uh, this LP was to partner this up with one of the Wario Land games. And that was early on in the year before Nintendo announced that Wario Land 3 was coming. So this was already on the docket. Just had to wait for a good time to where everybody had a chance to play it, find everything about it, so we can show off a lot of this, because... You know, with a game like this, you want to show it off as much as possible. Give it the best limelight you can. And uh, some plans go, go into the back burner. I wouldn't mind doing more uh, Wario Land. I'd be down for it. I'd love to do three. I've only played two. <laughs> see, I don't like... Oh, see, uh, Pepino's location right there. Huh? That's a, that's a museum in North Korea. 
What? I know. I had to check. It's like, wait, all right, all right. what? Those were geographical locations, or like uh, uh, latitude, longitude, and it led to some museum in North Korea. <laughs> Yeah, I've been taking a look at these uh, these Patreon names, and one of them was "Help, I couldn't think of a funny uh, funny Patreon name." That's how most of this game was funded. It was uh, through solely through Patreon, I think. And that's good. People saw a product that they wanted and funded it. Good yeah. job. It's it's like he just started saying, "Hey, I'm making this Pizza Tower game. Support me if you want." And uh, if we get to this level, I can work on it full time. Then, and well, I guess I guess he did. Are but, you in here? No, I'm not in here. Damn. <laughs> I'd like to be, but... Maybe for this, uh, the sequel. <laughs> I like this one. So for some reason, everyone's just, just wants to kick his ass, and he's like, Oh, no! Why? I'm gonna make you mad at me again! I'm out to here! <laughs> then he has an idea. How to get these, uh, these, these guys off of his back. Hmm? How about a free pizza? Free pizza? Hey? Uh, he, look, <laughs> he looks like he's going nuts off of, like, hot chili fumes because he's desperate yeah free pizza we never actually saw him make pizza how do we even know he's legit well i mean i i want to think that uh from the experience he's had i want to believe he knows a little bit more about how to make the perfect pizza Did, Wh didn't you learn anything where's the end result i actually wanted to see him present a pizza to all of his baddies hi <laughs> Insert a funny name. Well, uh, I should talk about uh, judgment at this point. Huh? They're gonna. Oh yeah. They're, they're gonna grade us at the end, and we have uh, several choices here. We have you suck. Okay. We have confused, which was back when the game was based on how many enemies you killed and other stuff. Ooh, okay. We have that's the one, officer. <laughs> that's the one for getting him hurt a lot. And, uh, we have, uh... Is, is they, they were gonna be part of that old build, but they don't work so much anymore. They're, they're orphaned punchlines, I suppose. Got no judgment. He didn't do good or, do, or bad. Okay. Got not bad. Not bad at all. Alright, for, right. do, for doing such. We've got, ooh, wow. Wow! We've got, holy shit. Holy shit is the one I know of. And if you get, uh... Let's see. If you beat the game under two hours... So speedrunner numbers. You get you are quick as hell. <laughs> Good job, speedrunners. There's one specifically for you. And we're gonna see what we get at the end here. Oh yeah, so is uh saving snotty is that just having him in the ending? Saving snotty is or is a this... is a percentage. He used to, is he uh Oh, okay. It the this final judgment is all tied to tower percentage now. Oh, okay. So uh, th things like confused and uh, that's the one officer mm -hmm. don't really land so much anymore because game doesn't count that anymore. And hey! the end. I think he lost all his money yet again. To Mr. Stick. To Mr. Stick. Well, congrats, Pepino. Now you will be judged. Now for Pepino's final judgment. How'd we do? Here it is. With no S ranks, oh. all treasures, all secrets, keeping Snotty alive and all that. Oh my god! 93%, so we get not bad, not bad at all. Awesome. 95 would have gotten us a wow, and I think uh, an S rank or two would have uh, put us over the top there, perhaps. It goes up to 101, though. Ooh. So hey, I'd, I'd say that is indeed not bad. Not bad at all. That was a fun run, dude. That was a fun run. A very fun run. So when are we doing the 101%? Oh, there we go. Snotty approved. And Snotty John approved. approved. And John approved. That's and how you get, that's your 1% for the 101%, I suppose. Oh, okay. And we're giving the not bad ranking. It used to be that uh, you, you couldn't uh, try it again, but they figured that people wouldn't play the game again if you could only do it once. So you can uh, go back in the game and try again, get get better ranks and get better scores and get what you missed. Okay. Let's see how you do. Yeah, so this has definitely changed since uh, since we first picked it up when it just released. So there's been plenty of patches. I just never looked at the patch notes. Huh. Well, it's from the builds, not so much the patches. Well, I mean... I think the patches yeah, just fix little, that's what I meant. Just, that's just little meant. bugs here and there that uh, they caught in playtests. What's this? I'm sorry. What are you? We're getting all the secrets. You get sound test! Nice! Sound test! Sound test! Alright. So we got all the, all, all the greats here. 
Yes. <laughs> special little dance animation as well. You got this, Pepino. Hell yeah, dude. Who the hell is that in the background? Is that Mr. Saucman? I think that's the that's the Secret King. Oh, because those are his eyes we jump into. Ew! Oh, I didn't want to know that. Well, now you knew. Now you know that. Uh, you, you jumped into all my eyes. Good job. Mash play on that beat box. <laughs> I saw you duck into the beat. Look at you. Eh, yeah, cold spaghetti. That's, that's one of my personal favorites. I had to put it as the ending theme, of course. Uh, yeah, they, they got all the songs on here. Everybody go play Pizza Tower. What is it? $10? 15 20 20 Go get it. It's the cost of a pizza. Okay, you know you want to play Unexpectancy. I might. I'm just kind of going through here. Don't preheat your oven. Don't preheat your <laughs> oven or the song won't play. <laughs> there we go. There it is. Get down! Yes. I'm glad we share a similar love for Unexpectancy Part 2. But, uh, what I really want to draw your attention to is, uh... Receding hairline! <laughs> Pizza Mayhem. Oh. Is this what it was before Pizza Tower? This was the old opening. Ah, cool. Complete with vocals, a la Wario Land. What? Gives it the, uh wacky 90s anime-esque opening. That's fantastic. <laughs> huh. I'm glad they changed the opening. Sick dance moves. Yeah, go secret king. Go secret, go secret, that's, go. That's, that's how I dance too. Uh, uh, unblinking, constant smile on face. Swing yourself from side to side. Come on, the secret king. Do the secret king. <laughs> Don't take steps. Let's do the okay. secret king all yeah. together now. No steps here. Don't take steps. All right, that's enough of that. Then we get all the secrets. Oh, right. Every secret had its own, uh, had its own theme. It used to be the, like, they had one motif, but then every stage got their own secret motif. Ah, oh, see, I love that. To my knowledge, there's no reused music tracks, right? Every single level, every single secret has its own theme? Yes. That is fabulous. All right, well, uh... What on earth is next? I don't think uh, we have much else. That's, that's about it, really. So, thanks for watching Pizza Tower. We got one more after that because, well, that's the thing about pizza. It's a thing of self-expression. So what, we're hap what would happen if we were to make our own? Ooh. 